back on, boys and girls. <laughs> Welcome, kitties, to another edition of The Nooner. I am your host, the Puerto Rican at large, High Noon, bringing it to you. I've missed you all. It's been a few months, man, and I'm going to tell you, man, when we first started this mission together, we was all on lockdown. That being said, a lot of things have changed in a couple of months, right? Like, uh, well, we're starting to see light at the end of the tunnel, basically. We was robbed of a summer last year. You know what I'm saying? We wasn't able to really do much. Yeah, the world isn't the same exactly as it was before, but there is some normalcy going on, especially here in Texas. Much love to the DF Dub. Oh man, yo. I'm getting kind of thirsty. Yeah, I think I'll take a little sip of my drink. Boys and girls, it's about to be the 4th of July. There's gonna be stuff happening. I don't know, the weatherman said it might be rainy, it might be sunny. Go out and see stuff. This weekend is just gonna be a lot of events. Check your locals, man. Check your peoples, man. Go out. If there's anything that being locked down has taught us, man, is that don't take shit for granted. On a lot of no kids, this weekend, apart from being 4th of July is also UFO day, okay? So watch your anus. The news, here we go. If you didn't hear already, I have a single out. It's called Stay Up. It's a summer jam. I want y'all to check this song out, man. It's out on YouTube is out on Spotify, it's out on, on Apple Music, H-I-6-H-N-double-zero-N, high noon, stay up. And I want you to listen to that while you eating barbecue or like roller skating or dancing or on your way to a party or at a party, whatever the occasion, man, play my jam, get into a good mood, get into a good mood right now, I'll tell you that. <coughs> smoke, man. Gotta get this smoke out of here. Yeah, the red planet. You already know. As you know, Hanu loves to travel. I'm from New York. All right. I don't know if you can tell. I had a chance recently to go back to New York. Love going back to the city, man. It was a little bit different going to a COVID New York. Everybody's masked up and everything like that. Still, COVID hit New York really hard. But it's good to see the, uh, the city bouncing back. Love to all my people in New York. July 12th, High Noon is back in Miami. All right? Don't say that I didn't warn you. I know that you're going to see this before then. I'll be back in Miami causing a little bit of havoc. I might be filming in Miami for my next single. So you better look out for me. Better keep in contact with me. If you friends of mine, if you follow me on social media, keep tabs of where I'm gonna be at because I might be out there filming and you might be in my next video. The Nooner doesn't have a format. If you're expecting to see some type of structured show or whatever, that's not gonna happen. I do what I want. I say what goes. If I want to throw a commercial in the middle of my show, I throw a commercial. So here's the first ever noon commercial. There is a reason why they call it the dead of night. Until something breaks the silence.
You just gotta build the network. Everybody knows I love fucking with the 80s. I don't know why, man. I don't know why I got love for the 80s, man, but there's a lot of cringe, man. There's a lot of cringe in the 80s. Today's though, today, I, bro, I was like blown away when I saw this, man. When I heard this, when I saw this. For whatever the reason, you know what I'm saying? I like digging in the crates. I like looking for samples, you know what I'm saying? I like identifying samples that I could identify in other songs. If I hear a, a, a song that has a sample in it, I'll be like, oh shit, yeah, I know that sample, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's an old, like, digging in the crates mentality. That's basically what it is, all right? So I'm over here listening to old 80s stuff, you know? And I come across this song that, yo, like in the very beginning of it, I was like, yo, that's hard, man. Like if I was to sample that, that would be crazy, man. Like if you used to hear this, like the beginning of the song, that's just gold, man. That's like any of my hip hop heads out there, man. Like if you hear the beginning of this song, you go bananas, like you want to sample it. You want to fuck with it, right? So I'm over here checking out this sample. And the song is from an artist named Benny Mardonis, all right? Benny Mardonis did a song called Lift You Up, I think it is. Yeah, it's, it's Lift You Up, Lift You Up, right? Is that that song? Somebody needs to, to fact check me on the name of the song. Uh, but if I don't know the name of the song, here go. All right, so you heard the music, right? The music is solid, man. Like, it's a dope groove. When it came out in the 80s, this song was a monster hit. I was way young when I first heard it. Regardless of the fact, man, I never paid attention to the lyrics, really. And when I sat down to listen to this shit, I couldn't believe what I was hearing, man. Foul bitch ass, bro. Yo. Yo, the first thing that he says in the video, right? She's just 16 years old. They tell you to leave her alone. And he gives you a face like. Fuck Benny Mardonis, bro. 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 I can't believe this shit was on the radio and they let that shit slide, man. I really can't. I really can't, man. I feel like punching somebody. I can't stand it. I can't stand it, man. I can't stand it. Bullshit, man. Cancel that, motherfucker. Well, boys and girls, I think we've reached that time. It's about time for me to go. I'm gonna sign off, leaving you with this special message. Be good or be good at it. I'll see you later. Yeah, I'm going to have to cut that.